There's no normal way to cope after the loss of a loved one, but a group in Phoenix is making sure families do not have to do this alone. Stepping Stones of Hope invites children and adults to come together to share in the grieving process. Chloe Marr shows us just how beneficial it can be. Pay and Nip knows how it feels to lose a loved one. I blamed my mom, myself. Like when people commit suicide, there's a lot of blame um, that happens. Peyton lost her dad when she was nine. Two years later, she started in Stepping Stone of Hope's camps. That was a good way for me to start talking about my feelings without having the pressure of seeing like a counselor or having like those one-on-one -on -one sessions. The camps are designed to help kids, teens, and adults grieve, connecting them with others in similar situations. Peyton now using her own experience to help others by volunteering with the program. It's really nice to have them all open up and start talking about like their different feelings and stuff amongst the group and then and they realize there's other people out there like me and I'm not really alone. It gave us coping skills that we could use at home um, and it really developed a lot of hope for the future. Anna Wilkes is the director of the program and she also knows the benefits firsthand going through the camp with her daughter after losing her husband. We find that when people come to camp, they're very quiet, they're very withdrawn. You do see quite a transformation from the beginning of camp to the end. Whether the loss was one year ago or seven, Stepping Stones of Hope welcomes grievers at any stage. Find a full list of camps and other programs online at steppingstonesofhope.org. In Phoenix, Chloe Marr, ABC 15, Arizona.